Hi there, Jess Felbenser here from Felbenser.co, giving you today a review video of the Sensio coffee machine, the HD7818. Uh, great little worker. This is not a new machine that I'm going to be showing you, but I figured I would do a review video uh, because I've seen a lot of questions about this particular machine. So here we go. This is the machine, and this one is. Um, about two years old, I think. Now, to give you the story behind the purchase of this one, we thought the one that we had before, which was pretty similar, was had it. So we thought, well, you know, it was like three years old or something, and it had been doing great, and then it wasn't making very much coffee, and so on. And the water was going through slowly. So then we thought we'd just get another coffee machine. They're not very expensive, these. I'll leave a link in the description so you can have a look. And um, what I particularly liked about it was the fact that it can take the dosettes, simple coffee dose, uh, little round pockets of coffee that you get, depending on what country you're in, what you call them. We call them dosettes here. And um, if you're going to do a double, you've got the double deep one you see that takes two at a time so if you're making a single or a double coffee and um we thought this the the one we had before was dead but then i thought well i'll just give it a clean and see if it can still work and maybe it can still make coffee and it has since then that's the last two years been continuously running at work so i have my coffee machine at work and i have my coffee machine at home and they're the same version of machine so there you go um, good sturdy machine and this is like in the one at work must be now five years old and is still going it makes coffee for everybody so there you are now this machine has some very interesting functions here's the big red flashing light as soon as you turn it on which means it doesn't have any water in it so you just take the little water canister off the back take the water canister off the back so got two little lugs little ears just hop it off and pop it, pop it under the tap, fill it up with water, yip it dip It's got a maximum level indicator, as you can see. And then you just pop it back in, sit it back down, <coughs> excuse me, and it's ready to go. So now it's slowly flashing, see, which means it's heating up, which will give me one minute to put some coffee in. So now um, you can use the usual dosettes, which I usually do. And here's my coffee machine with its packet of dosettes in it. Here you are, see? And these, um, because I like trying different types of coffee, um, I can find all sorts of coffee that is in this format, the Sensio format. Um, you can, of course, buy special Sensio coffees. And... Um, There'll be a link for that as well. So I just flatten mine down. I, I take care with my coffee because if it's not flat and you've got a lip up here and it lets the water all run underneath. So I flatten it down and then we just put the little lid down. And it's got a little spring clip on it here. I'll just show you. It flattens down so it holds well. And then it's a little spring clip. It just holds it tight. So that's all sealed. And just whilst I was blabbering on about the coffee, it's heated up and ready to make a cup of coffee. So, we'll just go back. San Marco, great cup of coffee. Um, Italian, of course. So, um, I'm just going to choose a particular little cup. You can have all sorts. And you'll see it's got a one cup button or a two cup button. Now, if you're like me and you drink a lot of coffee, and you like big cups of coffee, then here's my big cups. Um, I would use the two cup. Or if you're having your friend round and you want to have two cups, then you would do it like this, which you can do. You can put two cups on here, side by side, like so. And you would then use the double dosette version to hold two dosettes of coffee and run them through at the same time but for right now because i'm in desperate need of a cup of coffee working so hard making this review video 
that I will then press a single cup. And there we go. Just let that coffee come through. And depending on how you like your coffee, some people can um, stop this in the middle and let the water sit hot in the grains for a few more seconds, depending if you want to do that. Now, of course, if you do do that, this has already been started on a single, so if I press the single again, it's going to overflow. So I'll show you the other functionality, which you can turn on, and then you can press both buttons at the same time once it's got to temperature. See, it's just heating up there. You can hear it. Just getting up to temperature. Bum, 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 bum. And you can then dispense as much coffee temperature water as you require. Or if you want to sort of make um, an espresso into a long coffee, depending on your taste of how much water you want with your coffee. If you want it very short, you can actually just do this and cut it short as I have here and have an intense cup of coffee with all that caffeine boost in it. Or you can simply put a bigger cup and have a longer cup of coffee. So here we go. I'm just going to press the two buttons here and fill up my cup of coffee. See that? See that? You get some serious more coffee out of there than you would if you just let it run. So that's a little, little hint for you. And there you go. One delicious cup of coffee from a very versatile machine. And I'll show you the little functionalities. He's got a little bit stuck on here. I'll just put him into my little coffee, coffee cup bin. And there you go, coffee cup, very easy. So that's very simple to clean. And then taking my cup of coffee and having a slurp because I deserve it. Mm, that's pretty good. Um, cleaning is very easy with the this machine because this little piece just pops right out and you can stick it in the washer and this even opens up here uh, which you can't do with one hand but it just pops off and you can scrub the clean because as you will know coffee has um, oily residues which are a bit sticky and uh, over time will build up on the machine anyway there you go that is the HD7818 Philips Sensio solid working great coffee machine which you can do pretty much anything you like with and with this deep version here I have actually successfully made coffee with ground coffee you can get these little adapters if you like you just fill them with coffee or tea if you want to have a, a kind of infusion or something and then pop it in and make yourself a cup of coffee from a specialist grain if you like grinding your own or something like that anyway cheers that's the philips sensio coffee machine review video and here's to the next one i'll leave a link in the comments below bye for now